でもまだ人たちもお父さんに当てたことがないえアンジェがすごいんだねそうすごい私のお父さんは超すごいんいやいやアンジェさんあライオンすでに死人も出ていてどうか救援をお願いします<笑> My daughter left the nest and returned an S rank adventure. Okay, so first and foremost, my friends, welcome to Fall Anime. I'm probably gonna say welcome to Fall Anime probably a few times throughout all the videos I end up putting out on the channel, but this is a should you watch this anime video. And you know, the first thing I wanna I say is this show made quite an impression on me. This show, though, I do understand that it is not for everybody, okay? I completely get that this may not resonate with you whatsoever, especially if you're like a teenager and maybe you're under the age of 20. Like, I get this may not resonate with you at all. But regardless of age, whether you're 9, 12, 15, 30, 50, If you resonate with what seems like to me pretty good writing, then I think you will resonate with this show. Now, here's where my angle comes from. And my angle and my opinion on the channel is very much my own. I don't look at it from like how top down on everybody will see the show. I can only comment on how I see the show. And sometimes you may or may not agree with me. You may hate or love what I say. And that's mostly why you and many others come back is because they either want to disagree with me so hard that they just keep coming back. And, you know, I do that too. Or like you're like, yeah, me and this dude, we like, we're pretty aligned. And that's why you come back. Or maybe you're somewhere in the middle of like you, you go both ways depending on the show. And that's why you come back. So, with this specific show, it resonated with me because I am a father. I'm a father of, of, of two kids one, one、um, girl, one boy. And my girl's my older one. So, that resonates with me very hard. She's getting close to the age of how、um, the baby here was, you know, it went from, you know,、uh, zero to 12, right? And then, and then she went out. And one of the things I always think of as a father and parent, and You know, you're depending how old you are, you know,、uh, your parents definitely went through this or are going through it or will go through it soon, depending what age you are on. And for those who are parents or who, who may be a little bit older, maybe don't have kids yet, this is something to think about, you know,、uh, you know, when you have them is we're always, we're always in the moment, but we're not always thinking too far ahead. And eventually we're all going to get to a point to where. Your kids will leave and they never come back. And what I mean by that is, like, not that they, that they, that, and you might, you might be the kid in this scenario, right? Whether you're 25 or 30, whatever. It's like when you go and visit your parents, like, the, the bond that you have is never gonna break, you know, but like, Once you leave, like you're pretty much gone forever. Yeah, you may come back to visit. You may even go a few times a week, but the reality is like the permanence of it is like you're gone. And I found not, I don't want to say emotional, I don't want to say I got emotional, but like I found like it very in, endearing in the fact that you have this dude who was virtually alone. He was an adventurer and he found a kid, and you know, that became his daughter. And you know, now he has his little girl and she's leaving home, and he has to deal with that silence, right? Like, he, he was this huge adventurer, you know, very strong adventurer. He ended up losing his leg in like a really big battle, and he went to go and not run away, but he went to go settle down. And、uh, before he probably really settled at being alone, he found this little baby and he took it in. And then he had 12 years, right? You have to assume he went from maybe like age 25, maybe age 30 to now probably in his 40s. You know, being a little older, dude, and now having to relearn once again to be alone.、Uh, now it's been five years since that. And, you know, he's looking forward to his little girl coming home. And it's just something that's so endearing. And I think it's really cool. And I, you know, in reading the, the synopsis of this and、uh, reading, you know, kind of like, you know, what the show was about, even watching the trailer, I was like,、mm, I don't know about this one, but it's like, It really did hit a chord with me. And、uh, on the opposite end, we have Angie or Angeline or whatever her name is. I think her name, I think she goes by Angie. I think her name's Angeline, but goes by Ange.、Uh, you have her who she's really quirky and 
she's really about her dad like she thinks he's the coolest thing since sliced bread and she's like 17 18 years old at this point you know and she still thinks he's like the coolest thing ever she's probably gonna get there and find out that maybe he's not quite uh superman anymore you know he's older it's been five years since she's been home she's gotten a lot of experience she seems to be like really really like s-class like really uh um relied on by the guild so she's probably even stronger than pops at this moment so she's probably gonna have like, a, a reality to come with but at the moment she thinks he's still like the coolest thing to ever grace land and like that's just such a cool thing to have and she's quirky she's weird and awkward and uh all of these other different uh emotions and that's what makes her a really cool character as well too so i think i'm i'm here for the journey i really like where this is going uh i think if this video does well i think i'm, I'm gonna cover this weekly i really really like the show now from the other angle you know i definitely understand because this is a should you watch a video i think if anything that i've just said kind of like hits a chord with you in some way shape or form I think, yeah, absolutely, you watch this show. I think this show is going to have something for the people who can, for the people who can either put themselves in the shoes of either Ange or the dad, or folks who immediately do actually resonate with something that this show is trying to convey. I think that's really cool. And then you, and then you have the whole fantasy and and magic and you know uh, demons and all the other things that come with a fantastical kind of show. Uh, now, the opposite is, I understand, like, should you not watch the show? Well, I think if um, if you're not a parent, uh, I think if you are someone who maybe doesn't have a close relationship with family, uh, I think if, um, if you're not a big person on, you know, fantasy and this very specific, like, time period that it's capturing where, you know, there are no... no um, steel revolution has happened yet it's very like you know uh bricks and stones and and wood and uh adventure guild if this is not your vibe you know i think those are the times where we're like yeah i can see this not hitting a chord with you or maybe you don't really like Angie's personality she's quirky she's weird she's out there she's about her pops if you don't really like that then yeah this might not strike a chord with you and if you're not about you know uh uh uh, a kid and and their and their parent probably going on adventures together and and you know solidifying a bond even more and maybe finally seeing her have interest in a boy and how dad deals with that if that doesn't sound appealing this probably won't be a show for you either and i think if that's the case i think that's completely okay and i think that you know there's so many anime a season i have a list of anime i'm for sure watching that's like 12 or 13 I have a list of anime that I think, which this one was a part of, that I think could be good. And that's about a list of 11 or 12 anime. So overall, I think there's a solid 25, 26 anime this season. So if one doesn't make the cut, I think that's okay. And if that doesn't make the cut with you, for whatever reason, if it's a silly one, it's enough for you not, don't watch it. You don't have to, you know? So either way, should you watch it, in my opinion, absolutely yes. I think the writing's cool. I think the direction's cool. I think where it's going is cool. I like the premise. I like what it's about. I absolutely say yes. But I understand the no part of it. So this one, we'll strike it up as a maybe. I'm going to see you if this video does well. I'll see you on episode two. If this video doesn't do well, no problem. Thank you for watching this. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Let me put down, if you have nothing to say, put down just Ange, you know, Ange, or put down Dad or Pop. Put something just small and cool in the comments just so it helps the algorithm of this, uh, you know, get this out to more folks. And I'll see you on the next Fall Anime. Peace out, my friend.